Okay, so I wanted to make a quick video on what my meal plan looks like and the tools I have in front of me, okay? So I always have my paper that shows um, so I can know how many containers I have in a day. I have my Fixate book. I have up this printout of what goes in each container, okay? I have my containers out so I can see them and then I make my plan. So I wanted to give you just a quick of one of my days. This is today. So a shake is a red with a half a banana, so that's half a purple. I put some spinach in it, and then pe a peanut butter. That's my orange. So if you look at those, those are the containers I used, and then I check them off. Um, for snack later, I had some turkey roll-ups. I always have those in my bag ready to go. That's a red container. I did have my yogurt, granola, berries, and honey this day, and those are the counts. That night, I decided we're doing taco night, so I have meat lettuce, cheese, Frank's Red Hot. I prefer red, um, the refried beans instead, or any beans, maybe even black beans, instead of having the taco shell, but they do have um, those taco boats that you can have instead, that can be your carb. And then later on that night, I will have peanut butter with half a banana. So this is a day, this is food that I actually like to eat. Um, can I change it up? Absolutely. But I find things that I love. So I know this is always my shake. I love the turkey roll-ups. I switch up my lunches and I switch up my dinners. So you just have to find the balance in those yellow containers because you only get two yellow containers. So here's another one. If I decided to have pizza for lunch, right? That would be a yellow for the crust. The blue would be there and I probably have some veggies on it. And then for dinner, you just have to see what you have left. But the best thing is, guys, if you really portion this out correctly, you should be able to have a meat, a carb, and a vegetable every night for dinner. So you should be fine. And then always there's something left over at the end of the night for a little snack, a peanut butter, and a half a banana is exactly what I love to have. On the weekends, I try to save my carbs during the day so I can have popcorn at night or something like that. Now come back to this. Here's all the things that go in the greens, the purples, the reds, the yellows, the blues, the orange, and the teaspoons. Don't get hung up on it, but do your best to stay in those containers. Use them as measuring cups. Don't look at them like um, you have to jam it in. Just do your best, okay? And, and you will see results. Now, if you're working out every day on top of it like you're supposed to be, you're going to be seeing a lot of results. And I think that's the key. Picking dinners, um, this book makes it easier, but you also have On Demand, which has the Fixate show. So there's lots of ways to get this done. And I know that you guys can do this. The hardest thing to do is plan. I can give you my meal plan. I think I've actually sent it in my welcome email. This is one of my meal plans. I just write across the top how many containers I get because we figured that out. And then I put the things in. I love those egg cups because those egg cups um, are count as two um, cups. It counts as a red cup and a green cup. So those are amazing. And we could talk more about those. Baby steps. Just little things until you get where you need to be and we'll work on your meal plan. So print out some blank pages and choose the things from the email that I sent you. Choose some lunches, choose some breakfasts, and plan your family dinners. That's where I want you to start and make sure you're getting your shake in there. All right, I'll see you later.